We go in three, two, and one. We're now talking with very well-known Bahamian architect and um, artist, Mr. Jackson Burnside. Mr. Burnside, can you tell us a bit about Dome Studios and your participation in transforming spaces? Well, Dome Studios um, started in 1977. Uh, when my wife ran a, an operation called Pamela Jones Fashions and we printed and produced Bahamian fashion, um, designing very special Bahamian fabrics. And uh, we, we decided we wanted to make some souvenir items and we began to produce the graphics. I made the graphics and she ran the prints. And, and that started us uh, doing a number of interesting things. And then we went on to to, um, to do a show with my brother Stan Burnside, and so it was a two-man show uh, in uh, Kayla Lockett Edwards. Um, uh, it wasn't an art studio, but it was a, uh, a school of uh, music, a school, uh, place of culture. Uh, and and that, that started us off realizing that you know, we could make a difference here yeah, by showing off the Indian art and the things that were created in design. And um, over the years, uh, we, we've been exhibiting a lot of the Indian art. Here on, here on Village Road, we kind of revived the concept. And we try to show off as much as we can the, the new ideas and the new thinking of uh, the Indian uh, creative uh, artists and community. So it's, 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 it's been fun. Now, this show is, as you know, based, it was an invitation to designers and to artists to, to either express themselves or to make a work of art or to make, create a designer object that um, would use materials that would ordinarily be thrown away. It could be anything. It could be a piece of furniture, it could be fabric, it could be paper. You know, certainly we throw away a lot of plastic bags, we, we, we cut down our trees and we throw them away, we tear down our buildings and we throw the materials away, we, we, we go on at the regatta and we, 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 we drink and we produce a lot of glass bottles and, and a lot of aluminum cans, it takes a million years for, uh, for glass to decompose, so they think. And it takes about 500 years for aluminum cans to decompose and so when you when you when you consider how much of that material we throw on the side of the road and, and we're, we're, we're pushing into our our landfill, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff that will will at some point poison our people. Mm -hmm. and, and, and so we thought we should we should really highlight that and we'll draw some attention to it and, and invite the artists to use those materials to see what else can they be. Uh, it causes us to be a little bit more sensitive to the fact that we are throwing these things away. Do we really have to use that? Do we really have to use all the plastic bags we use and all the styrofoam cups? And imagine all the stuff that comes from the fast food. You know, we, it takes us uh, half an hour if we are polite to eat um, a, a plate of uh, uh, macaroni and cheese or whatever it is. I mean, I would call it the names, but you know. But then the styrofoam is it could be a thousand years before it, it breaks down. Uh, so, so we thought it was important for us to to just look at the stuff that we create, just create a lot of stuff. And 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 we spend a lot of our resources to buy that stuff. And of course, the world spends a lot of its resources to produce that stuff. And so we thought that we we. Art, art could cause the dialogue, it could cause people to start the discussion, and it could cause people to criticize themselves because, you know, you want to criticize the art, you want to critique it, and, and, and then you start to say, oh boy, I'm talking about myself. Uh, it causes school children to come in and, and, and to ask questions. Uh, not just asking questions of a teacher, but asking questions of themselves and the things they do. The ways they, they create. So we think this is a very, very relevant um, okay. yeah, exhibition at this point. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so,